What's good YouTube and welcome to Beers to Fathom Northwood Hitchhike. So we did play the first episode on the channel. So if you are new here and haven't seen that, uh, please go check it out. I think you would enjoy it. I'm excited to hop right into it. So let's go ahead and read what we're, you know, about to get into. Fears to Fathom is an episodic psychological horror game where each episode unveils a short story narrated by the ones who survived. You are playing episode two. More episodes are coming soon. Episode playtime about 40 minutes. Okay, this is a a long and hefty one and by the way i do have the carson house downloaded as well so hey i will be getting that one you know recorded and uploaded as soon as i can if you are new here consider subscribing to the channel and liking the video it really helps out a lot and let's hop right into it come on dog did my did my game freeze <laughs> ah! fears to fathom episode two i'm ready northwood hitchhike are y'all ready ah! june 16th all right, here we go, here we go. This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. All right, I still remember this very clearly because of how uh, creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first, but getting it out may help even if it's just a little bit. All right. I was one of those people that loves gaming conventions. All right, I've never been to one of those. I'd go to every convention I get the chance to, and sometimes even meet some of my online friends. Though my parents were always thrilled at the idea of me going on interstate drives, but a plane ticket would have been too expensive. Oh, uh, this convention I was at uh, went great. Uh, and it was now the day to drive back home. But when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'll take the long way to avoid traffic. Bro, are you serious? It was a little over 12 hour drive. 12 hours, dude. Like, I'm, I'm good. All right, y'all, here we go. Is it a little dark? I don't know. All right, can we shift? Oh, just a nice peaceful drive uh aiden williams all right all right so we got messages from dad you called yeah i think i'm going to that convention uh could i get your car for like five days please with who aiden the internet friend he's a nice guy no you're not going on a 10 hour drive by yourself well i've already made up my mind i'll drive you why don't you understand anything let's talk when i get home drive safe holly don't forget to call me yeah got it dad aiden williams anything else leaving now drive safe holly okay whoa whoa okay we got other cars going by i ain't gonna lie that scared me <laughs> discord we got ticks so oh my gosh see if i can get uh the car let you know finally going to take a milo on a walk lol all right lol okay the plane is on heck yes wait you're getting the car yep big girl uh you sure ash can't come I'll get the skateboard too. Saw this really cool skate park nearby. Sounds fun. Discord, where are you? Almost there. I don't see you. Um, Peach shirt, it was fun. I had a good time. Thanks for joining me. Smiley face. Again, you are driving all the way back? I don't really have a choice now, do I? Could have left tomorrow morning. Okay, give me a call when you uh, reach back to your cave. Okay, dad. I'm not sure if it'll be this lifetime though. What do you mean? Stuck in the biggest traffic jam of the country. That sucks. It's not too good here either. I think it's the people from the convention. That's it. I'm rerouting here. You got to do what you got to do. All right, y'all. I just wanted to say if you don't care about all the reading, you know, just skip by it. I don't mind. All right, y'all. I am nervous. Whoa, this looks crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Ooh. I ain't gonna get copyrighted for playing this, Emma. Uh, driving at night is really therapeutic for me. Well, at least it used to be. Ooh, boy. Man, driving at night, man, I don't know, man. It's not my cup of tea. Dad, all right. Got another message from Dad. Um, Where did you reach? Still about six hours away from the city. Got stuck in a jam. Okay, we're still driving. All right, I don't like the ominous music coming in. Ooh. Gas, oh no. Near halfway through the drive, I realized I was low on gas. Well, let me get on my side of the road, bro, before somebody else come through. <laughs> All right, are we nearing a gas station somewhere, please? I feel like I'm gonna get jump scared, dude. Wait, slow down, slow down, slow down. 
Let's read the message. Told you to take the flight. Man, should have did that, bro. Should have did that. What's this? Oh, that's nothing. All right. Okay, Dad. I'm text. I'm driving. Like I ain't supposed to text and drive. You trying to get me killed? Oh, Holly. It's gonna be late when you reach back. Hope you're feeling all right. Okay, so we are a female. I'm, I'm guessing. So cool. All right, we made it to a gas station. Slow down. Turn. Wait, no, wrong way. Oh, sorry, sir. I might scratch up your car. <laughs> all right, where we going? Where we going, bro? I suck at driving. Jeez. <laughs> All right, y'all, that's how you park. I'm not gonna lie, it took a huge amount of time to do that, but you know, are we even on the right side? Oh no, please, say it ain't so, say it ain't so. All right, I think we're good anyway, so. Gas station, Norwood gas station. All right. Man, woo. All right, so, hello, sir. Um, What are you picking up? uh how's your night going he just looked at me oh no he looked like somebody bro okay was that a message from mom holly mom that's it all right cool um uh, the car is fine okay so what are we doing obviously getting gas but is there anything i can pick up i'll take a thing of this orange juice i ain't gonna lie mm. hello sir ma'am hi can i get 10 on pump two thank you dot 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 you heading to the bridge by yourself the bridge uh yes why not a lot of people headed down there this time of the year be careful uh what do you mean for about a century now many people have gone missing down there okay and people who went to looking for them never returned locals say the norwood valley monster had torn them up and hung them upside down on trees <laughs> sir i am a woman out here by myself why in the world would you tell me this <laughs> you can pick cool what <laughs> well thanks for the gas uh can i can i get this whoa what's that noise whoa who is that hello you need to pay for that ma'am I saw somebody in my car though. All right, bro. I don't need it. What? I want it though. Whoa, he scared me, bro. All right. One more thing. If you see a woman in a white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. Just step on the gas hard as you can. Who is she? Some people say that she died in a car accident there on prom night some say that she seeks vengeance um after she was murdered there oh my gosh regardless she's out for blood whatever you do never ever under any circumstance pick up a hitchhiker those people out there on the road putting their thumbs out they ain't what you think ma'am they just ain't. Whoa! Who is that? Sir? Sir! Oh! <gasps> oh! What was bro doing to my car? Nah, dude. Okay, what does mom want? I don't know if you'll find any shop at this hour, but we're out of dog food. Could you get something for Milo? I'll pay you back sure 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 bro did something to my car dude he did something to my car okay i was looking right at it is this it all right got you got you uh can i get this sir that'll be five dollars ma'am Ooh. all right let's get up out of here man i would have said sir can i sleep at the gas station tonight please can we put this anywhere in the car or do we have to hold it the whole time uh does the trunk open oh it does all right bam cool 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 uh gas gas so are we good or no what all right y'all finally let's get some gas Ooh. oh man 
I filled the tank and I was off to the road again. Okay. There's nobody in the back seat, right? <laughs> oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh, whoa, there's another car there. Dang. I need to pay attention, huh? Being on the road, you do realize a thing. What? Monsters truly do exist. Every single one of them looks just like you and me. Whoa, what's that? Oh, that's true. That's true, bro. Hold on, slow down the car. Let me see what mom said. She said, surprisingly, there is uh, there was dog food at the gas station and you don't need to pay me for it. It's not expired or anything, right? I don't know. I didn't check. Let's just get whoa, 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 whoa. Where's my light? Where's my light? Oh. <gasps> Bro, come on, dog. That's not funny. I can't even see. Bro, that guy did something to my car, bro. What was going on with my lights? Whoa. Cut the music off, bro. Cut the music off. What? Oh. Okay. At least we're not alone on the road. I feel better. Sir, I'm gonna need you to speed it up a little bit, though. I ain't gonna lie. I can't see, dude. Oh, <gasps> bro, it's leaving me. <gasps> oh, where am I? I don't even know if we're still on the road. Hello? I'm trying, y'all. I'm trying. This is freaking creepy. All right, I think we're good. I think we're good. Oh, finally. There we go. Oh. Let me ask you guys something. What would y'all do if you were in this situation? And I'm saying that you saw the guy, you know, tinkering with your car. What would you do? How far do we have to go, man? I feel like I've been on the road forever. Okay, so this is the bridge the guy was talking about, right? Cool, 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 cool. Oh, man. This does not feel good. Is there somebody behind me? Or is that just the, the river? Y'all. Y'all. Oh, what happened? My game is freezing. I'm sorry. Bro, I thought I saw somebody walking, dude. Let me chill out, chill out. This random dirt road in the middle of nowhere and I cannot see again. Okay. And you're not gonna speak on this at all? Like you're just gonna sit there in quietness. Dude, I'm ready for the driving part to be over with. I'm not gonna lie. Whoa, what's that? Oh, it's just a, a rabbit. Okay. All right, coming up on another bridge, I think. Cool. There's this very weird thing about that night. Oh, I saw two big logs in the middle of the road blocking the way ahead. Okay, what are we supposed to do? You want me to get out? Oh no, oh no. It almost seemed as if someone had deliberately put these there, but I didn't think too much of it at the time. It was probably homing at the gas station. Okay, so we can, those were very heavy, so we can move them. All right. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I'm nervous. Keep it sliding. Keep it sliding, please. And you next. Whoa. Okay. That one was just floating. All right. I th think. Oh, wait. I'm moving it back. No. Where are you going? Is there a ghost here? Dude, I'm telling you, there's a ghost out here. What is going on? Oh, so we have to move it that way. Got you. I'm tripping. The ghost is trying to help me. All right, that should be good enough, right? Let me get back in the car, please. Oh. All right, let's go. The car wouldn't start back up. Are you serious right now? Are you serious? Come on, dude. 
And just like that, I was stranded in the middle of nowhere with no phone service. Uh, but I wouldn't be lying if I say I didn't feel the slightest of unease. I don't mean to make this sound like a cliche horror story, but... Throughout my life, I was told to not take rides from strangers. What did I tell y'all, man? What did we learn about strangers in that reaction? But at that moment, I had no choice. I was scared to think how long it would take for someone to pass. Oh, man. Just sit there in your car, lock your doors, man. Whoa, is my car smoking? Hold on, let's get out. 10.23 p.m. Wow, it's getting pretty late. This is not good. It got darker. Jeez, I saw our car coming. Where is it? Okay, hey, hello. Wow, you just gonna leave me stranded. I'm a woman out here by myself. Pure evil. I didn't understand how somebody could leave another human human being stranded like that. Wow. That's the world we live in. 1043. So she was there for like another 20 minutes. Wow. It's getting even darker out here. I can't even see, man. I do apologize, y'all. If you can't see either, because I can't. Let me stand here in front of the lights, man, so we can get a little bit of illumination here. Okay, here's somebody. Hello? Uh-oh. 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 And I'm walking up to the car anyway. Sir? Um. Hello? Hey. You're the girl from the gas station. Who are you? Oh, wait, is he the guy that didn't talk to me? I didn't think anyone would stop for me here. What are you trying to do out here? I think my car just broke down. Dot, dot, dot. I can't call for help. There's no phone service. You think I can get a ride? Where are you heading to? Uh, just up the road. Hop in. Thanks so much. Could you wait till I get my stuff? Hurry up. Just throw it in the back. I won't be here for too long. All right, man. Give me a second. Note to self, bro. And to y'all, if you ever are out by yourself like this at night, bring a flashlight with you, bro. You only had two hands. Oh my gosh. This is going to take a minute. All right, y'all. I think that's it, man. I don't know what's going on with my brightness, but it's just way too dark. I can't see. Bam. All right. I think that's it, sir. You need to hurry up. I don't have all day. I'm done. Finally. Now hop in. Be quick. Cool. Ooh, get me out of here. Get me out of here. Let's go. All right. Ooh, how you doing, sir? How you doing? All right. Peaceful night. So you ain't going to say nothing? All right. Uh, hmm. So you won't tell me who you are, where you're going. Uh, I'd rather not say if that's okay. If you say so. Uh, yeah. Would you tell anybody your business? Especially a stranger. You're really lucky. I had to be on this side of the um, town tonight. I must say, you are one brave young woman. How's that? You got any clue what's happened to your car back there? Uh, I think it was the battery. Are you sure? It's my dad's. It's pretty old. Oh no, bro look like Adam Sandler from the side. I ain't gonna lie. So what did you think about what he told you back at the gas station? Um, he really creeped me out. Interesting. Idiot tells that to every person traveling down here. Okay, so we can talk to him. So is it true? What, the monster? Let's see. I've never seen the monster for myself, but there are. There are some things, and I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them. Hey, listen, I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them, and you don't be bothered. Wow, and y'all, I apologize I have to read like that because, um, you know, the words are coming up pretty slow. 
But we definitely saw somebody messing with our car earlier, bro. That's who did it. You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not the best with people. Oh, I understand. I understand. No problem, sir. All right, we fade into black. We fade into black. Please, can we go somewhere where there's more light? 12.08 a.m. Woo, it's midnight. After a little bit of small talk, he dropped me by a, a motel. Apparently, they offered roadside assistance. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful, there are all kinds of people out there, he said ominously before leaving. I would have said, sir, wait, no. Oh, don't go. Oh, man, it's even more dark. All right, so is this all my stuff here? Got you, got you. Hello, sir. Roadway in. Uh, the man was putting out the creepiest vibes imaginable. Gal need a room to shack up for the night? Uh, how much is it for one room? $40 for a single. Pay cash only. All right. Room number nine, right over there. Talk about the car. $90. Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. Woo. Ducks. A hundred and something dollars right off the bat. Good. I'll let Tommy know. And one last thing. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. What is that supposed to mean? All right. So we got key room nine up there. Oh my gosh. All right. Can we grab our stuff? No. All right. Room nine, room nine. All right, so what number is this? This is one, two. Three, this is going to take a minute, y'all. Whoa, whoa, that door is open. Hello? Hello? I couldn't just go into any room. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, sir. I apologize. Five six seven okay we got service now all right hold on y'all hold on okay so dad i'll be all right dad where did you reach why are you not picking up the call what do you mean reroute dad i may have to stay by a motel tonight got you got you um let's see holly question mark hey where are you at your dad's calling me all right so we got service now right Still no service though, actually. What? Eight and nine. Ooh, we got a chair here. We can sit down and chill. All right, cool, cool, cool. It was nice and warm inside. Ooh, except there was a smell, a type of musky smell you get from old houses. All right, all right. So what about my stuff up here? Can we grab that? I just want to make sure you know that's secure. Okay, we can't grab it. What? I ran all the way over here for nothing, huh? And why in the world did I walk all the way out of my room and, and left the door open? Like, what am I doing? Close that right now. All right, we got a TV. Superman do. Can they do this? What? <laughs> Copyright claim? Let me cut that off, bro, because I'm not trying to get claimed at all either. All right, closet. Whoa, it's kind of scary in here. Can we go in? Oh, we can go in. Okay. Hello? Hello? Oh. So we're going to have to use that later, huh? Got you, got you. I'm glad I walked in there, bro. I would have never known. Oh my gosh. All right, all right, all right. That didn't scare me at all, bro. I'm just like, bro's figure just took all the scare out of me. <laughs> Why is bro built like a, I don't know, a M? What are you doing here? You scared the crap out of me. <laughs> who are you i'm tommy room service here at roadway inn the finest stoop over in the nor in norwood uh what were you doing in there you know cleaning stuff guy at the front desk gave me this room <laughs> okay i'm gonna have to ask you to sleep outside while i make the room or step outside i'll just get my stuff 
All right, awkward. All right, y'all. So I just had to pause for a minute to check my recordings and stuff. I hope everything is fine. Um, so we are going to get our stuff and we're going to head on back. So I will see y'all then. 2000 years later. Whoa, he scared me. I'm not going to lie. Jeez, dude. I'm going to just throw my stuff down there. <laughs> Do you know who bro looks like? He looks like that one guy, bro. What is his name? Creepy picture. Why would you have that up? I would take that down immediately. All right, sir, you can get out now. Had a word with Joe about the situation. All right. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. But don't you worry. It's safe here. Uh, I go get your car. All right. And also, the room's phone is not working. If need anything, just ask at the front desk. So you mean to tell me I got to walk all the way over there? Okay, we've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. But you have a good night. You should still get it fixed regardless. Like, bro, what? All right. Now what? What do we do now? Um, Let's move our stuff out the way just in case we have to run from something and it's like they're blocking us. You know what I mean? All right. Bathroom, bathroom. Um, uh, Is there anything in here? Nothing suspicious. Close that. Can I not close it? It won't let me close it, y'all. All right, whatever, whatever. We got the sink here. Whoa, what's that? What did I just hear? Crouch, 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 crouch. How tall am I? Oh, okay, okay. All right, all right, y'all. So I'm guessing we go to bed. All right, I'm gonna just stack all my stuff up there. All right, and we're gonna lay down. Cool. Oh, okay. All right, the blinds are open, dude. I don't like that. What was that? I hear water. Hello? Oh! <gasps> what is it? Call it a foresight, but there was something very off about this place. Dude, who? I couldn't help but shake the feeling that something wasn't right. Bro, I know you saw bro standing there. Oh, that's the same guy from the gas station. I bet you a dollar. The feeling of tiredness. A hot cup of coffee could help. I thought to myself, dude, you still going to go out there? Oh, okay. I saw the coffee machine earlier. Heck no. Okay. All right. It was over, right over here, right over here. A coffee machine, dude. I wish we had one of these, um, over here. So espresso, uh, cappuccino. What do I want? French vanilla, not available. Oh, I low key want the cappuccino. Can I get that? Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Hmm. Consuming these items helps you stay awake. I got you. I got you. Consume it. All right. So they, it just comes out just ready to go and. What the heck happened? Whoa! Bro, am I high? Oh. Bro, we're not we're not going to be able to get back to the room, dude. This is crazy. Whoa! Hold on, y'all. All right, so it's straight across, straight across. We got drugged or something. Absolutely crazy. We can't read. Bro, why is it? It's moving farther away from me. What? No, I'm just going backwards. Man, that's why you got to leave them drugs alone, dude. All right, we made it back. We made it back. Can I get back in my place, please? Close the door. What do we do? Lay down? We need to lay down, dude. Oh my gosh. Y'all need to check that cafe machine, bro. Like what in the world? 3.18 AM, y'all. So it's three o'clock in the morning. 
in the morning. I was sedated. Oh, whoa. Okay, I thought the phone wasn't working. Hello? Hello? Uh, am I talking to aliens on the other side? What is that noise? All right, you ain't got no flashlight. Cause these lamps ain't doing nothing. All right, all right, all right. Let's leave that open so we can get some, get some light in here. Uh, water here. Whoa, I hear somebody knocking. Who's that, who's that? Whoa, did bro open the door? What was that? What the? F hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me look out the window first. This ain't good. This ain't good. Crouch. I can't see. Oh, I think it's the guy from the front desk, sir. Who is it? Joe from the front desk. Open the door. Oh. Didn't I specifically tell you not to wake anyone up? I have complaints. What are you making all those, those goofy noises for? Whatever it is, just keep it down, miss. Is that why your eyes are all red? Mention the coffee machine. Y'all's co you coffee machine did that to me. Are you messing with me? We don't have a coffee machine. Sir, come again? It's right over there. Okay, okay, here. I've got, I've had enough of you crazy goons here for once. I thought we had a sober guest, but I guess I'm the crazy one here. Follow me. I hate my job. Bro, move out of the way, bro. Follow me then. Come on. Bro, he looks like a freaking, um, locked character from Smash. What happened to your, I can't even see him at all. All right, there he is. Okay, sir, come on. It's right over here. I bet you a dollar, bro, is gone. Whoa, why is that open now? Hello? Okay. Dude, it is completely dark and I can't see anything. And it's gone. It's gone, sir. Oh, wow. Go back to your room. I swear it was right here. I said go back now. All right, all right. That's absolutely insane. Bro, that guy is doing something, bro. We saw him at the gas station. He did something to my car. We saw him looking for it through the window while ago. He put that coffee machine there to do something to me. All right, the table, we got the medicine here. Cool. Requires water. All right, it's going over here to the sink, I guess. The gulping sound effects always get me, man. <laughs> All right, we cooling now. We good? We good. I don't know what kind of medicine that is, but it works fast. <laughs> oh, why is that open? Why is that open? I know I didn't. Okay. So what do we do? Go back to bed? All right. Matter of fact, turn some Superman on. Turn some Superman on, bro. Crouch. Okay, I'm not seeing anybody. Whoa, whoa! Bro, somebody's taking pictures of me! What the heck was that? Nah. Dude, I'm speechless. I don't know what to say. What? You're not going to comment on that at all. Hold on. Turn Superman off. Turn Superman off. What am I hearing? And I can't. 
I'm not opening the door, dude. Who? Nope. Nope. Who is this? Who was saying hello? No, I'm not going to the door, bro. Who is it? Please open the door. I need help. What do you want? I need your help, please. Please open the door. Hey, no! I know you're in there. I'm finna run straight to the closet. Please leave. I just need to talk to you. I swear I'm not a cop. Please go away or I'm calling the cops. Ready? knocked him out <laughs> to this day i find it really weird that the manager inferred not to get the police involved as it would have affected motel's reputation and let go of the situation i believe that the town could have been home to a cult or a drug ring or possibly something even worse tommy arrived with the car after what felt like a year i never went on a long trips on long trips again i would always take airplanes oh my gosh oh <gasps> Wow, that's it? That was good, dude. <laughs> wow. Man, hey, that's why, especially if you're a woman, dude, out here, it's not safe, bro, in some of these places. You just, you have to be very careful, man. So, does that mean, like, like bro, he's not by himself? There's more of him out there, right? Specifically in that town, like, what the heck, bro? All right, y'all, so that was Fears to Fathom Northwood Hitchhike or Norwood Hitchhike. I hope y'all enjoyed. I just want to say if you're out there on your own, especially at night in the middle of nowhere where you don't know anybody or you're in this new place, just be careful, dude. <laughs> Keep your doors locked. Make sure you have a flashlight with you, please, or even a gun. All right, I'm, I'm just saying. If you are new here, consider subscribing to the channel and liking the video. It really helps out a lot. And I will catch you all in the next one. Peace.